what is up everybody and welcome to episode 5 if I'm not mistaken of our Undertale Let's Play. Of course if you guys missed the previous episode you can always find the link in the description down below. But with that said I want to get right into things. It's been a while since I've played some Undertale. Um, this series hasn't been the most active but um, I really enjoy this game. I just decided to take a little break from it uh, to focus on some other things. But we're back with Undertale, and hopefully you guys are excited for some more. Of course, if you are excited for today's episode, go ahead and drop a thumbs up on the video. So that would be greatly appreciated. And I have no idea why this music is so intense. But if you guys missed the previous episode, you can always find the link in the description down below. But, um, let's see. I guess we have to throw these things. And then walk on them. Yeah, I have no idea why the music. So, like I said, it's been a while since I played. I feel like I ended off at a. Oh, look at that! They blossom. They blossom in the water. I feel like I ended off in a weird area, but uh, we have no time for you. We have no time for you. We have to progress through. We have no time for you. All right. Um. If an air is made, the bell blossom can call bridge seats back to where they started. Um, I'm assuming they have to be in fours. Um, what? I'm assuming they all have to be like in a straight line. Yeah. Yeah, whoa, how are we gonna do this then? What on earth? What on earth? Okay, well. Um. Will this make a. This will, but now there's no way. Actually, getting across. Whoa, okay, how on earth are we gonna do this? What if I did. Um, like this. Would they float across? They would. Hmm, maybe this will work. I might be onto something. I might be onto something. I do kind of want know what's down there, but... There we go. See, that wasn't so difficult now. A long time ago, monsters would whisper their wishes to the stars in the sky. If you hoped with all your heart, the wish would come true. Now, all we have are these sparkling stones on the ceiling. Wishing room. Okay. Oh. Nah. I ain't got time for you. I ain't got time for you. Can we stargaze? Look through the telescope? Sure. Check wall. I'm guessing it wants me to check this wall up here. Okay, thank you. Thank you for the the hint, the tip. Ancient writing covers the walls. You can just make out the words. The war of the humans and the monsters. Why did the humans attack? Indeed, it seemed that they had nothing to fear. Humans are unbelievably strong. It would take the soul of nearly every monster just to equal the power of a single human soul. But humans have one weakness. Ironically, it's the strength of their soul. Its power allows it to persist outside of the human world, even after death. If a monster defeats a human, they can take its soul. A monster with a human soul, a horrible beast with, an unfath with unfathomable power. It's an illustration of a strange creature. There's something very unsettling about this drawing. Hmm. 
Alright. Okay, so it's over here. Oh, I don't like this. This is kind of eerie. Take me back to Papyrus. Oh no. Oh no thank you. No thank you. Oh goodness. Ah, oh he got me. Ah! Leave me alone, I did nothing wrong. Oh my goodness, you have to be kidding me. We are going to die here, huh? Oh my goodness, how did I avoid all those? Oh please, oh no. Oh my goodness. Just let me escape. Oh, he's following me, no! Okay, I'm in the, I'm in the grass. What's this dude doing here? Okay, I'm Audi. I'm Audi. I'm dipping. He's excited. Yo, did you see that? I'm never washing my face ever again. Man, are you unlucky. If you were staying just a little bit to the left. Yo, don't worry. I'm sure we'll see her again. Let's not... Let's not see her again. Alright, let's go ahead and save. Knowing the mouse might one day extract the tree might extract the trees from the mystical crystal, it fills you with determination. Let's save up real quick. Oh. Let's move on. Of course. It's an odd looking telescope. Oh, we can't look through that one. Okay. No problem. What's up with you? What's a star? Can you touch it? Can you eat it? Can you kill it? Are you a star? Wow, that's deep. That's deep. Right. Let's see what's up in here. I relocated my store, but there's still no customers. Fortunately, I've thought of a solution. Punch cards. Every time you buy a, uh, an ice cream, you can take a punch card from the box. If you have three cards, you can trade them for a nice ice cream. They're sure to get the customers to come back. I mean, it's a good idea, but... Um... I'll buy one. I feel bad. The box contains one card. Take a card. Take it! It's a box for some important cards. It's empty right now. Okay. Well, let's buy it. Let's buy an ice cream. Just because I feel bad. This man has no customers. We already talked to you. We already talked to you. I didn't mean to talk to you again. My bad. Ooh, I really like this. I really like the vibrance. I'm, I'm assuming that's just water. It's like a lake. I really like the vibrance that's giving off. Wow, I really, really love this. This looks so... I don't know. There's something really nice about this. Okay, how do I get to the duck on the other side? How do I get to the duck? How do I get to the duck? Through here? You hear passing conversation. So, don't you have any wishes to make? You hear passing conversation. Hmm, just one, but it's kind of stupid. Uh, let's go down here. Ah, uh, a mold small. Ah, uh, we have to, we have to fight this thing. We have to fight this thing. Oh, wow. How did I... I messed that up. There we go. You won. Yeah, get that thing out of here. Get that thing out of here. Alright, where are we supposed to be going? The power to take their souls? This is the power that the humans fear. Hmm. What is that? What 
What on earth? Hello? <laughs> what is this? Hey there, no stewer here. I'm Onion Son? Onin Son? Onion Son? What? I have no idea how to pronounce half these names. Alright, let's just move on. You're visiting Waterfall, huh? It's great here, huh? You love it, huh? Yeah, me too. It's my big favorite. Even though the water's getting so shallow here, I I have to sit down all the time, but... Hey, hey, that's okay. It beats moving to the city and living in a crowded aquarium like all my friends did. I would, I would assume. And the aquarium's full uh, anyway, so even if I wanted to, I... That's okay, though. You hear? Undyne's, a, Undyne's gonna fix everything, you hear? I'm gonna get out of here and live in the ocean. You hear? I, I you hearing ya. Hey, there. That's the end of this room. I'll see you around. Have a good time. And waterfall. Alright, let's dip. Let's a dip. Oh, wow. Get out of here. Get out of here. Right, what's this thing? The northern room hides a great treasure. Okay. Let's see what's up here. There's a piano here. Play it. Yes. So X quits. Okay. Yes. Well, what on earth is this key? Haunting sound echoes down the corridor. Won't you play along? Only the first eight are fine. I feel like I have to play this in order to progress. I have no idea. <laughs> I have no idea. I'm not sure how you play that. What the heck? This power is no counter. Indeed, a human cannot take a monster's soul. When a monster dies, its soul disappears. An incredible power to be needed to take the soul of a living monster. There's only one exception. The soul of a special species of monster called a boss monster. A boss monster's soul is strong enough to persist after death, if only for a few moments. A human could absorb this soul, but this has never happened, and now it never will. Alright. Ooh. It's a statue. S the structures at its feet seem dry. Hmm. Please take one. Okay. You took an umbrella. I mean, I don't mind if I do. Oh, what's he doing here? Yo, you got an umbrella? Awesome. Let's go. Oh, we're, we're moving along with him, I guess. Right, where exactly are we going? Man, Undyne is so cool. She beats up bad guys and never loses. If I was a human, I'd wet the bed every night, knowing she was going to beat me up. Okay. A little too much information for me, but okay. So, one time we had a school project where we had to take care of a flower. The cane, we had to call him. Mr. Dreamer volunteered to donate his own flowers. He ended up coming to school and teaching the class about responsibility and stuff. That got me thinking. Yo, how cool would it be if Undyne came to school? She could beat up all the teachers. This man fantasizes about her way too much. 
Um, maybe she won't beat up the teachers. She's too cool to ever hurt an innocent person. She tried to hurt me. Hello? She tried to hurt. She tried to kill me. Yo, what's this? Where are we going? Ooh. Okay. Turn the umbrella. Uh, do not. I want it. Yo, this lake is way too steep. Yo, you want to see Undyne, right? Put up your umbrella and climb on my shoulders. Oh, we have to get rid of it. We have to get rid of the umbrella. Yo, you go on ahead. Don't worry about me. I always find a way to get through. Yes, you do. So. You take off, I guess. You take off, I guess. Let's go ahead and, uh. The sound of muffled rain on the cave top. It fills you with determination. Let's go ahead and save. The humans, afraid of our power, declared war on us. They attacked suddenly and without mercy. In the end, it could hardly be called a war. United, the humans were too powerful and us monsters too weak. Not a single soul was taken and countless monsters were turned to dust. Hmm. Hmm, I say. Hmm. It's all silent in here. I don't like that. What's this? Oh. Oh, great. Oh no. Uh, I've done nothing wrong. Yeah, she's trying to kill me and I'm obviously very, very innocent. I've done nothing wrong. Where am I supposed to go? Oh, ah! Come on now. Where on earth? Ah, shut that. Wait, can I? Oh my god, I didn't mean to do that. I'm trying to figure out where I need to go. Oh, can you please stop? Okay, she never does it like... Oh no, she does do it directly when I'm standing. Alright. Let me get the heck out of here, please. gone I don't know what I'm supposed to do where am I going hello is anybody out there can anybody help me um oh my goodness leave me alone Oh no! <laughs> Sounds like it came from over here. Oh, you've fallen down, haven't you? Are you okay? Here, get up. Arax, huh? That's a nice name. Oh, we didn't catch their name. Alright, now where are we? Alright, 
right, well, I think we're going to go ahead and uh, save and wrap up episode 5 of Undertale right here. Fails <laughs> with determination. Okay. We're going to go ahead and wrap up episode 5 of Undertale right here. Of course, if you guys did enjoy the video, don't forget to leave a thumbs up as that would be greatly, greatly appreciated. Hopefully, you guys are enjoying Undertale. I definitely am. I'm having a blast with it. It's... It's wacky at times, but it is a lot of fun, so I hope you guys are enjoying it as much as I am. Either way, if you did enjoy, drop a like as that would be appreciated. And take care, have yourselves a good day, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.